Hey, what's up guys? Stay blessed, never stress. It is Azik, and today I have an informative video to help you guys sell your duplicated cars the right way, not hit a penalty box and not get banned or hit a daily limit so you can only sell like one car a day. So where I got this information first off the bat is in the link in the description. It is from 7sins.com. I... I am not taking any credit for this. These guys have made an awesome thread. You guys should go watch or go um, read it into the um, how far they've gotten into this. It's amazing. It's awesome. All credit is for these guys. I have linked the thread in the description from Nick Gore. Um, he posted this and I think he's a contributor. I'm not too sure if he's the only one that found this, but he does credit everybody else. And I'm crediting him for this. All the information in this video, this goes out to these guys. They are amazing. You should go check them out. Um, in the description below, I'm leaving the link to this thread. So pretty much what this sums up is that how to sell your duplicated cars. So I've been doing this and it's worked out. I have not hit any, any daily limit or anything like that. So pretty much what I do is I go in my garage and sell a car and then I wait seven minutes. So I've been doing this before I even saw this thread because I got informed by my other friend and um, he, the way he did it was he was selling two cars every 12 minutes and then he hit the daily limit. So, and I was doing it the one car every seven minutes and I never hit the limit, maybe because I would, didn't get close to selling, um, all the cars that I had, but usually what I like to do is, um, the most effective way, if you have a friend, um, that's willing, you know, you and your friend are doing this back and forth. So what I like to do is I like to sell my car, wait seven minutes and just clear out my garage, but only keep the car in the sixth position because this is going to be the car you're going to use to duplicate so don't sell this one i go to my office and if you can see um i'm in a solo public session i just released a video if you want to learn how to get into a solo public session every time go check out that video on my channel it's one of my most recent up um, uploads next to this one now um on all my garages i'll show you guys after this but leave that car right here next to the 1a logo leave that car do not sell that one that is the car you're going to be duplicating and what I like to do is I like to go and get my last car. I just sold a car um, not too long ago. So it is, I'm, it's been seven minutes. So now I'm just going to go and get another car and show you guys that I have not hit the daily sell limit, that this method still works. If you guys haven't seen how to duplicate this, go to my channel and look at the duplication video for this because it is very good and it's very helpful and it works. And, you know, right now I have, if you can see in the corner of the screen, I have $32 million. So it's crazy. I don't know. Um, this glitch has been out there for a while. Um, I don't know how long Rockstar is taking. Probably when I upload this video, who knows? It could be even patched. But, you know, go ahead and try it as well. Right now, I haven't had any updates or anything like that. I'm going to try it again today after I clear my whole garage. And um, so we're just going to make our way over to the Los Santos Customs. Uh, once again, i like to say thank you to the guys that made this thread. It's the most informative one I've seen out there. Um, it's crazy. People just tell you some brief stuff and all of a sudden you get banned. These guys actually go and test things like this out and risk their accounts from getting banned or hitting the limit and anything like that. So these guys deserve all the credit where credit is due. So go check them out. The thread is in the description, like I said before. So now we're just into the... Um, Los Santos Customs in the Anis LU Retro Custom. So before, also I like to do is I like to damage the vehicle a little bit and you only lose like a K. It's not even that big of a deal. $1,000 off of 960K. Come on now, look at that. 957K, almost 960K. So, you know, you're selling almost each car at a million dollars. You That's like, come on, that is the craziest thing out there. So this glitch is awesome. If you guys haven't seen it, it's amazing. So I just got another uh, almost 2 million there, almost $34 million. So after I sell my uh, car, you got to wait seven minutes. Okay, wait seven minutes at least because if you don't, you're going to get hit in the penalty box that can move you down to selling cars for only like you can go to 10 vehicles per day, eight vehicles per day, six vehicles per day, five vehicles per day, four vehicles per day, three vehicles a day after you reach these certain levels. So on the side, they've had this section where they created levels and that's the penalty boxes that people hit. So the, in these levels, this is how many cars you can get sell. So if you get put into level one, then 10 vehicles per day, level two, eight vehicles per day, and so on, so on. And it just keeps on going down and down. So they're really testing everything out and it's awesome. So stay up to date on that thread and if you want to find your sell limit um on here it says sell until you get the limit message at benny's and keep on um noting it down the previous sold 
the vehicle sold previous to the limit message is your limit uh remember the number your limit will be the same tomorrow wait 24 hours before selling again so if you hit your limit remember that and just go and wait 24 hours do not sell anymore just go do some crate missions or anything like that um you know go any missions just to get gta off your back and then if you're level one through six you will want to raise your level by doing the following how to increase your sell limit and it's listed down below in the thread so go check it out it's an awesome thread i've said this all, uh, so many times in this video but really guys um go go check it out it's um it's awesome they're really awesome for this uh, of how they how much time and hours they put into doing this to help us out no benefit for them just to help us out and help everybody they could have kept this to themselves but they didn't and that just makes it really awesome they're they're really cool people um it seems so by how much work and put so they do see the error in how hard it is to get money in gta um i had a large or i had a medium um, warehouse and i was just selling uh, missions it took like honestly like the whole day just to get enough crates to fill up and sell for seven hundred thousand dollars um and that takes a whole day and with this you know solo duplication methods and or not solo but duplication methods you can make you know 10 times that money you know easily even more uh, you know one day seven one day equaling the 700k that's not going to get you anything in this game honestly if you want to get the more expensive big things that this game offers and it it just feels weird i don't i don't know why they do that you know they i mean obviously it's for money you know gta they want to make their money so they're gonna do things like that so they're gonna go and sell all their stuff and you know sell those shark cards to you so you know you spend like 80 dollars i think for like 8 million it's i don't even know probably even more it's not it's not worth it guys not worth it um so now i'm just gonna show you my other garages i have i you guys i it, it's a lot i'm crazy trust me i am stocked a lot so what i do is i bought uh, i filled up one garage made enough money to buy the second garage right there boom 2a if you can see it's just duplicated to the top this whole garage is filled also uh let me go show you guys office garage number three this garage is also filled man it's it's crazy this glitch i've i have not been wasting any time the best method is to just buy all the apartment once you have the money don't even worry about it okay if you and your friend are really gonna have hours and hours to spend on this look at this office three garage office garage number three f filled that's over you know millions and millions and millions of dollars right there okay and now i want to go and show you guys my other apartments okay you guys are probably going to be like what are you guys what are you talking about are you, this is all the garages you have right no it's not what i did is i went and i bought a bought the 10 gar 10 car garage apartments guys the 10 car garage apartments over there in the suites and the penthouses and i filled all those up okay all those up so i'm gonna go show you guys right now it's crazy it's crazy i filled all those garages up and that that's oh look at all this look at this besides the great um clubhouse or anything like that this filled 10 20 30 40 50 cars 50 and all these 20 20 22 for like come on like over a hundred vehicles ready to be sold and 960k each it's wild you guys don't believe me i'm gonna take you guys there right now so we're gonna go there i'm gonna get my kurama and or kurama i don't know how people say it but it's all filled guys I'm, i don't have to show you guys each and every one but i'll try and make it so the sake of this video but it's all filled so remember guys one car every seven minutes and please go check it out guys all credit is due to these guys these guys have been testing it so much and all these other um people that just put in time for this so you know go show them credit you know they're amazing for this and go to the link down below um check out all their information they're really awesome and i'm happy that they did stuff like this because you know people will get banned and stuff like that they hit limits and it that sucks it really does and i'm grateful that i haven't hit it yet you know i was lucky enough so let's go down let's make it over to my um apartments and i'll show you guys the rest of my garages so that's pretty much the best like you know this is uh, like what you have to do pretty much is to make the most out of this glitch is to make and um keep on duplicating cars sell it sell one car every seven minutes wait until you have or dupe until you have enough money to um 
buy another apartment dupe all the cars and the only thing that sucks is you have to drive what i do is i get one garage drive all the way over here and then once it's in the garage i get back in that car drive to the other garage but i park outside get out and then get into another car and what that will do that will make that car that you came in in the first place go back to the garage so once that goes back to the garage um you can take the next car and keep on doing it and so on and just keep on repeating that to fill up the garages so now we're just gonna go in we're gonna go let's say apartment number five look at that all filled out right there and then we're gonna go to the next apartment And I'm going to show you guys this last apartment because, I mean, you guys obviously get it. So right here, um, all this stuff is filled out. Here, one, two, three, four, five, six. Right there, guys. Six full penthouses, towers, everything. I got that. Uh, filled them all up. And I'm just ready. I'm ready for this glitch to get patched. I really am. You know, knock on wood, guys. Knock on wood that nothing happens and they don't somehow take out you know do something bad don't only sell these cars for like 100k or something like that because that would suck I, I would cry it's still money but ah god that's like one car one garage only is a million so that would really suck so you guys get the idea you know so i'm gonna do a breakdown right now dupe your cars after you dupe your cars oh sorry about that dupe your cars after you dupe your cars sell it for or sell it wait seven minutes no less then seven minutes guys wait seven minutes you know boom dupe it again or not dupe it but go get the car sell it wait seven minutes do that rack up your money buy all the apartments guys buy all the garages and just get that money right now i have 32 million and i do not have anything else to buy that i want the thing is about me i'm not going to go waste my money even though i have a lot i'm really stingy with my money i'm really smart by the way too with my money because I don't want to buy things that I'm never going to use and it's just going to take up garage space. See, I have the uh, Kur Kurama, Kurama, Kurama. I have the Kurama. I'm, I'm just going to say Kurama. I'm sorry if I'm saying it wrong and it's irritating you guys, but I have the Kurama and or Kurama and I use that once this glitch gets patched so I can do the CEO missions. The Kurama is the best car you can get. You don't die in anything like that. It's the best car you can get. So I buy things that oh there it is right there but i buy things that are useful i'm not saying other things aren't useful you know i mean go have fun you know but i'm just saying more cars that you put into garages is less cars that you can sell so you know for now don't buy anything yet just wait until it gets patched um and there's no more uh duplication glitches then go on a buying streak and you know buy all that money but also the um best uh way after you filled every single garage what i like to do is i like to um uh, if my friend goes AFK sometimes, you know, because, you know, Xbox, you can leave your Xbox on for like forever. So what he usually does is he goes to sleep while he's still in the glitch. So he'll be in there. When you're in the glitch, you can drive outside. You know, you not the other guy, not the guy, not the AFK guy, but um, the guy that's doing the glitch. You can drive outside, you know, return your vehicle. So what I like to do is I like to fill the whole car garage with dupe vehicles and then sell all of them besides the duplicated one. And then come back, fill all the cars up with LEDs again and keep on duping until you fill all your garage is in that's going to take a lot of time it's going to take a lot of time but come on what would you rather be doing duplicating these cars so you can sell for like a, a 900k each or do ceo ceo missions or biker imports what, what like really no no you don't want to do that so just don't be lazy <laughs> go and put in all your vehicles in the garages and then just call benny fill up all your spots in that garage with um elegies only fill one car only one garage i mean only fill one garage with elegies okay the other garages is going to be a waste of your time just fill one garage with elegies because you won't he's afk you won't be able to tell him to come back if you can then go ahead but if he's going to sleep left his xbox on for you just stay in there and then fill that car up move the cars cars to the next garage besides one the one that you're duplicating in the sixth spot and then fill it up with leggies again once you're done and then dupe them dupe them dupe them and then sell seven minutes apart but yeah that's pretty much it guys i'm sorry that took so long it's kind of like just a little uh talking video uh just some information you guys can have um pretty much the whole information in this video is in the link in the description so go check it out guys on seven cents you don't even have to make an account you can look at everything these guys the credit is for them you know thank you guys so much i like to thank them personally they are so 
awesome for doing this and if you want to this is where you can know everything the best organized most informative thread i've ever seen on this site um and these guys say it all they tell you all so thank you guys for watching the video if you like the video like comment and subscribe share the video so everybody knows and that is bad timing but take it easy and stay cool